one, it's really not that difficult making croissants at home. People do think it is difficult, but it isn't. I'll teach you a quick and easy way to make some laminated dough, which will make the perfect croissants for your wonderful family and friends. In the bowl of your stand-up mixer, you're gonna be adding four cups of all-purpose flour, which is 568 grams. You're gonna be adding one quarter cup plus one tablespoon of granulated sugar, which is 65 grams. You're gonna be adding two teaspoons of salt and two tablespoons of melted butter. It can be salted or unsalted, it doesn't really matter. All of these are gonna be added into the bowl of your stand-up mixer. In a measuring bowl, you wanna add one tablespoon plus one teaspoon of active dry yeast, and then you want to add 360 grams of lukewarm water. So we'll do that. And that's about one and a half cups of water that you'll be adding in there. And there we go. This you'll be letting sit for about five minutes till it gets bubbly. And then you will be adding it also to your bowl of your stand mixer. After all the dry and wet ingredients were added, mix for three minutes until you get a rough dough. Take your dough and place it in a bowl and cover for about one and a half to two hours. In the meantime, we will make the butter insert. Next, we're actually going to be making the butter um, insert that we'll be putting into the pastry and this is what we're going to be doing to make all the laminations. So first you're going to be adding into the bowl of your stand mixer, you're going to be adding three sticks which is one and a half cups of butter and then you'll be adding one tablespoon of flour and this will um, be mixed together so that we create a paste that we'll be adding to the rolled out dough in a little bit. First, you're going to take all that butter you whipped up and spread it all along the dough, leaving about a half inch around all the edges. Fold like a letter and put it in the freezer for six minutes. You're gonna to wanna to repeat this process two more times. Now your dough is ready to make pastries. To make croissants, roll your pastry out to eight by 20 inches and cut down the middle and then cut across for a total of eight squares. Take each square and cut it diagonally so you can roll it up. Don't you just love all the layers in this dough? Now brush each of the pieces with an egg and milk wash and then bake until done. When they come out, they are flaky and yummy. There are a lot of pastries you can make using this recipe. Just find your favorite and bake according to those instructions.